Hi, I'm John. I'm the author of several publications on BERT, and I've been a BERT developer since its inception. I hope you find the following video informative and educational. Oftentimes, a developer needs to support BERT reports that they did not develop. This could become a bit of a challenge, especially if the support developer is not on the same network and does not have access to the data source being used in the report. In this tutorial, I will show you how a developer can utilize the report document ODA and the report design extraction plugin to diagnose and troubleshoot BERT reports. The report design extraction tool will read a BERT report document file, which contains a runtime copy of the data that is bound to every element with a data binding in a BERT report, as well as the original report design file. Taking advantage of this fact, the plugin will extract that report design file from the document make a copy of each binding as a separate data set using the report document ODA pointing to the data in the original document file. This way, a developer can see the runtime instance of a report and make changes to it without needing to connect to the original data source. Both plugins are available from the BERT exchange. For more information on how to install the plugins, see the video entitled Installing BERT Plugins. To create a document to use, go to the Run Generate Document menu item. To keep everything self-contained, I will go ahead and copy the report document file into my Eclipse workspace. This is not a requirement of the tool. With the report document, a developer can use the report design extraction plugin to extract the report design, which will set up the report document ODA automatically. To do this, go to Window, Show View Other. Under the BERT Utility section, select Extract BERT Report from Document. I will go ahead and copy the location of the RPT document file from the Eclipse workspace. From the Design Extraction menu, select Browse. Select the location where the RPT document is located. With the location ready, select Extract. The tool will create a new report project, copy the document file to the project, and copy the extracted report design file to the project. Inside of the design file, the report document data source has been set up to use the RPT document as a data source. There are as many data sets as there are tables or charts in the original design. You will need to manually set the bindings on the tables and the charts. You can usually just say yes to creating new data bindings. This will change aggregates to regular data bindings, but for the purpose of troubleshooting, this is okay. As a quick tip, Make sure that the tables in the original report all have names as well as the charts. As you can see from this screen capture, it's easy for me to find which data set to assign to which element based on the names. Now, when you go to run the report, you will be running off of the RPT document file. This will make it easy to troubleshoot, especially if you do not have access to the original data source. If you found this tutorial useful, please visit birdexchange.org for more BERT developer tips.